in this video, I'm gonna give you guys a small little intro to exponential functions and how to actually generate them. All right, let's look at this word problem. It says the amount of bats in a cave is three on a Sunday evening. The total amount doubles every week. So you know when something's doubling, it's like take that whole amount and technically just multiply times two. All right, so how many bats are in the cave by next week since Sunday? So let's think about it. We start off with three. If three doubles, it's going to have to be three plus three, which is six. So there's going to be six bats come the following week after that Sunday. Okay, so now let's actually fill out this table. We started off with three. It doubles, and then it becomes six. When six doubles, it becomes 12. When 12 doubles, it becomes 24. And I know I'm saying doubles, but basically I multiply times two. 24 times two is 48. 48 times 2 is 96. And just to explain the table, that just means we start off with 3. That's why there's a 0 right there. One week after that Sunday, we have 6. The second week after that Sunday, we have 12, etc. All right. So about how many bats are in the cave by Wednesday during the second week since Sunday? Okay, now wait a minute, wait a minute. So now we're technically looking in between these two right here. We know that by the second week, we have 12 on that Sunday. But then when we get to Wednesday, it's about halfway through before we get to 24. So we can guesstimate an amount that's in between 12 and 24. So just to give an approximate amount, I'm just going to guess 18. Approximately 18. All right, now how many bats did we start off with? We start off with three bats. What is the rate? Well, we said it keeps doubling every week, right? So that means the rate is two. So looking at this formula right here, your initial amount represents your A and your rate goes into parentheses. So when I write my function, it'll be Y equals my initial amount, which was three, since it's doubling two to the power of X. And that's it.